Hey, um, it's almost four and I'm out of work and I just decided to you know, bring you along with me on a run because I feel like a lot of my friends don't run and I feel like they don't do it because they don't want to. So I'm gonna take you on my journey with me through a run so you can see what you're missing out on, which isn't a lot because it's it, it's whatever. And I'm also not using a tripod or any holder. I'm using my hand. But yeah, I am going to show you the misery that I put myself through so I can eat the bag of Oreos that I had this morning. On this day of recording, it was 50 degrees, so I only needed a short sleeve shirt and some capris. I got this armband from a running expo from a few years ago. It's pretty handy. It holds my phone pretty well. It's kind of waterproof and it can hold some credit cards. These earbuds were actually recommended by a friend and they're by School Candy and they're wireless and Bluetooth, so it's pretty handy when running. These are my newest running shoes. They're by On Running. I believe I have the Cloud Stratus ones. Um, they're pretty good. I like the support and I feel that they're pretty light so they're not too squishy but not too firm. Here I am taking a break. Um, I think today I went four miles. I usually don't like to stretch before I run because you're technically not supposed to because your muscles aren't warmed up so but if I do feel obliged to stretch I usually would do it after a, a mile or so in um, because the muscles are warm and they can stretch better without hurting myself. So here I am picking my nose and showing off the beautiful industrial architecture of Northern Virginia and whatever that is. Maybe I'm not supposed to show that. But I think uh, this might have been the midway point. Here's some more bridges. And I know that it wasn't like the best time of year to really record because all the trees are dead, but here are some Christmas lights at the mini golf course. That was pretty festive. And I was trying not to get run over by other runners and cyclists. And underneath this bridge, there was this beautiful graffiti art and the bridge smells like absolute armpit. So that's it. <laughs> 